Several people are homeless after a fire swept through their Providence home overnight. Now officials are investigating whether or not it is connected to several recent suspicious fires. Eyewitness News reporter Nika Nuosu has the details. New at 5 for the Providence Mobile News Service. Though officials are not using the word suspicious just yet, they say there are many similarities between the fire early this morning and the recent arsons in the city. This Priscilla Avenue home is now uninhabitable after a fire swept through early this morning. Providence fire officials say six adults and one child are now without a home, but they all made it out safely, though the flames were hard to fight. Firefighters were faced with an enormous volume of fire when they got there. It was still hot last night at 1 o'clock in the morning with the gear that they wear. This is just one of more than a half dozen fires in the capital city this week. There was a fire on Candace Street in the Smith Hill section just after 11 Saturday night. Then, less than 40 minutes later, crews responded to another fire on Orm Street. A little after 2 a.m. the following morning, another fire on Candace Street that officials believe is connected to the first blaze down the block. There is also a small fire on Vesey Street. Officials believe the fires were the work of arsonists. And though it has not been labeled an arson, officials say there are similarities between this morning's fire and the arsons last weekend. It was started in the front of the building. And scrutinizing this fire uh, a little more, more uh, uh, effectively than we normally would because of uh, the uh, similarities. This morning's fire and the recent fires from over the weekend are still under investigation. With the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm Neka Nwosu, Eyewitness News.